She's really beautiful. A little snowball. High point, stronghold of the White House. You know. <gasps> I don't like this. Lord Roderick. Lady Alyssa. Gwyn? Roderick, may I have a word? Thank you for accepting my father's invitation. I wasn't certain you'd come, but it's a good thing you did. Be honest with me. If things get bloody, are you on my side or his? My father honors guest right, just as you do. You didn't answer the question. I told you I'd try to talk sense into my father. And you did your part, putting up with Griff. Oh, I know how shit. difficult that must have been for you. But it will all be for nothing unless you listen to what my father has to say. You need to take him seriously today. Which means keeping a level head and thinking before you jump to conclusions. I'm here in good faith, aren't I? Yes. I suppose you are. There are lords who wield power. And lords who like to make a show of it. These walls hold a thousand years of White Hill history. A thousand years of bloodshed. But our houses were close once, and could be again. So much of our history has been lost. Shall we get on with it? The Great Hall is this way. Your soldiers seem on edge. Well, what do you expect? The way they see it, the enemy is within their walls. What's this? M my lady? Give us a moment. What? Is this your family? Shortly before Griff was born. Is that your mother? Yes. Though I hardly remember her. She died not long after this was made. What else is there? The father isn't one for poor. Your father doesn't smile much, does he? He used to. When my mother was still alive. Are these your brothers? The eldest three, yes. Carl died of grayscale a few years ago. Oh. Ebbets at the Citadel. Corrin serves Bruce Bolton. And Griff, of course, wasn't born yet. You. That must be you. A <laughs> much younger me. Yes. You look a bit like your mother now. My brothers were never kind to Griff. He was boastful, gullible, and quick to anger. But my father always defended her. A white hill is a white hill, he'd say. Come on. We mustn't keep my father waiting. Okay. I think I will screw this up really badly, but what can you do? I'm not good at these things. Well, isn't this pleasant? Where's your father? Strange. I'll go find him. Okay, we're so dead. She left us. Like you need to find a way out of here. Ryan for Griff, that's still our plan. The plan means nothing if we're dead. I'll look for an unguarded exit. Well, it's not that. What's Lord Whitehill planning? Bloodshed, most likely. 
We won't go down without a fight. Just follow my lead, whatever happens. Shit. Well, isn't this pleasant? All locked up like this? Mother, look at this. This ironwood's cracked. Oh. What? Did it crash? It crashed! <laughs> Maybe I'll talk to her before I touch that cracked ironwood shield. Are you all right, Mother? I don't know what Lud's planning, but I'm not leaving here without Ryan. Not when we're so close. I won't just turn and abandon him. Just stay close to Sir Royland. If things do get bloody, he's your best chance of getting out alive. Well, let's see. Don't crash. Mother, look at this. This ironwood's crack. I'm not surprised. The White Hills were never any good at the craft. Oi! Step away from that! Ooh. Ryan's here, somewhere. Inside these very walls. I think there's something going on with that crack thing. Sir Royal? Sir Royal and? I'll be ready for anything. Oh, sure. Can I go upstairs? That's far enough. Welcome to High Point. Lord. <laughs> I hear you've been looking for an exit. You're not nervous, are you? Rob Stark went to a feast, and look what happened. I'm nothing like Walder Frey. And unlike Stark, you don't even have bodyguards. Father, please. Can we just get on with this? Well? Oh, God. Why? You know, your father once called High Point a keep for the gods. What stonework, he said. What craftsmanship. He wouldn't stop talking about it. If you ask me, I'd say he was envious. High point is very impressive. It is, compared to your pile of timber. Lot, where's Ryan? Always worried about your family, aren't you? Let's toast to family! Won't you toast with me, Roderick? As a symbol of our goodwill to family. To, to family. family. Quinn noticed that? Now, tell us why we're here. 
The ironwood business is thriving, Roderick. In fact, the Boltons want weapons faster than we can make them. And when Roose Bolton wants something, I like to give it to him. So, in other words, you need our help. <laughs> Don't be so damn full of yourself. You foresters are headed for destruction. Yet, you know more about Ironwood than any house in the realm. Would be a shame for all that knowledge to be lost. Help me craft Ironwood for the Boltons, and I'll make sure you foresters survive. As if he protect us. <laughs> if you think you can threaten I'm us. I'm not threatening. So you're proposing an alliance? An alliance? I said nothing of the sort. He'd make us his slaves. Roderick, this could save your house. I'd consider an alliance. You see what I have to put up with? Just give him time. I told you. I offer you peace, and you spit at it. I offer opportunity, and you demand more. Need I remind you, you kiss my ring. Here's how it's gonna go, Roderick. Either you agree to my terms, or I'll have Griff tear Ironrath to the ground. He'll put it to the torch! This isn't the way to Let get what you want. Let me get slaughtering your small folk! Maybe you'll even make you watch. Funny you should mention Griff. Have you heard from him lately? What are you getting at? He's locked in our darkest cellar along with your entire fucking garrison. You didn't. You've imprisoned my son. He was there by order of the Warden of the North. I'll gladly return him if my brother returns home. We want Ryan back and we want him today. gonna kill him. Ryan! Mother! Roderick! You came, just like you said you would. <gasps> oh, Father, no! What are you doing? You imprisoned my flesh and blood. Mine! Let him go! He's not going anywhere! Listen to her! Don't I swear by the gods if you will... Let him go, or I'll have Griff This is killed. not what we agreed on. him! Not me. If you want to see Griff alive again... You think I'd get two shits about Griff? About my fucking fourthborn? I ought to kill you right now! Because you foresters never I'm learn. I'm not afraid of you! Can I fucking murder him yet? Try it! Ryan, I'm let go of me! Let him go! Everyone, no! I'll kill you myself! Roger, do something! Now, Roiland! <laughs> Okay, I think it's game over so I can start again. What the? Ooh, thank God. Thank God I died. Whew! Okay, what? If you want to see Griff alive again... You think again. I get two shits about Griff? About my fucking fourth born? I want to kill you right now! So, no attack. I will not accept the deal. Can I fucking murder him yet? Try it! Why did you all hold me? Let you Everyone go! Go on then. Do it! What? You think I want? I know you want. Don't test him, Roderick. Because for all your bluster, all your posturing, you care about your son. Whitey is still a Whitey. <gasps> you know what, Roderick? You're right. <clears throat> Ryan, come here. No. We'll make the trade on neutral soil. Griff for Ryan. A son for a son. <sighs> Fine. Now, get the fuck out of my hall, and the gods have mercy on us both when the Boltons come for their ironwood.
Now go. It's been a pleasure, beloved. <laughs> I'm so sorry, Roderick. I wanted ice to say ice. Oh, he's a badass. Oh. I think that was the end of this side. I think we're gonna see the end of Lady Marjorie and end of this place. There it is. Did I say the Lady East Marjorie? Watcher. Whoops. I mean Mira. <laughs> now listen up. None of those guards can live long enough to light that beacon. Because if they do, this invasion gets a whole lot fucking harder. Don't drop that. Can you fucking... How many men do you think are in there? Hard to know for sure. At least five, maybe more. To answer your question, too many to fight head on. Beacon. Is that a harpy? Of course it is. Those golden tits are everywhere in this bloody city. If those guards light the rope, the fire travels up to the bowl, and the whole city will know we're here. So we stop them. Aye. We'll need to take those two out first. Come on, let's get moving. That is a nice telescope. Beska. Hmm. It's nothing. Just forget it. Fine with me. Great. I'll take him. I've got the other one. Just keep an eye on her. I don't need him to watch me. Then prove it! What have you heard? Just sit outside the gates waiting. <laughs> Mother of dragons. She wants to scare us, but she will. Split up. One group will go high and try to climb over to the other side. What about them? That's why someone needs to stay down here. They get behind cover and shoot the men up top. Just don't let that one see you. There is a so, lot of things. Which will it be? We'll go over the top. You just make sure you clear the way. I am bad at shooting things, so... Meshka has the freaking arm. Peshka cannot do this. I need to help her. Help Peshka. You hear that? Oh, Peshka could do it. This Khaleesi calls herself the breaker of chains. We will break them. I think Croft got the easy job. <laughs> I think it's better this way. What happened? Not impossible. 
Tolton. Keep moving. Quick, the guards on the move. We'll take care of it. I'll get rid of them. X A B X A B Y X A B Y. Come. No, 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 no. It's too much. What? It's too much. You'll ruin it. I know what I'm doing. Doesn't look like you do. Little rat. Did you say something? Well? I said you're a little rat. <laughs> Clear down there. Hey. They're still up there. On the right. Take them out, and you'll be clear to secure the beacon. They break through. I'll keep them busy. Oh, this is so nerve-wracking. We can finish this. Just look at them. Two men. We've dealt with worse. Let's rush them and be done with it. What about them? You afraid of a couple of crossbows? We took on the Lost Legion by ourselves. We stick to Croft's plan. Take care of them first. All right. Yep, bitch. We need to do exactly what he says. That's what Khaleesi said. I should have closed it. Well, hello. Light the beacon. Nope. God, there was a crack. <sighs> oh, I can't believe you did it. Me neither. Croft! Croft! Wait your whimpering. I'm not dead yet. You hear that? Starting. Piss on it. Achievement unlocked the Son of Winter. Bye. 
Home at last. Well, then Back at High knows. Point, I wasn't sure your brother would survive the day. He nearly didn't. I was terrified when you called Lud's bluff. But you knew exactly what you were doing. <coughs> and now Ryan will be coming home. He'll sleep in his bed. Eat at our table. He'll be right here. Where he belongs. Restoring our family is just the beginning. Next we'll rebuild. Make ourselves strong again. <sighs> oh, Roderick. Sometimes you sound just like your father. My lord. Look. Why is it all Where are the gods? Don't say she fucking betrayed me. Dahlia? Duncan? Where are the Glenmores? Where's anybody? <laughs> Wait here. Oh, fucking. <laughs> Come on. Don't be so dreary. It was a joke. Oh, I'm hello. sorry. I, I should have laughed. Or maybe you think you can do better. Of course not. I I didn't need to offend you. Perhaps a song instead. I hear you've written a touching song about your dead brother. Am I in it? Let's hear it, shall we? No. No? I won't. Roderick! Roderick! Welcome back. Lord Ramsay, welcome to Ironrath. How... Courteous. Now I know where your sister gets her manners. What the fuck are We've you? We've had a lovely time together. Haven't you, Tarkin? Say it. Say it's been lovely. It's been... lovely. And you. I'm told you're a man who can't be broken. I've decided to come see for myself. Goodbye, Talia. I think you're dead. Why the fuck? Whenever things get good, okay. Then they get bad again. Ethan was the first forester I killed. Doesn't have to be the last. You don't know what you're in for, Garrett. What you're asking my brother to do. The North Grove isn't what you think it is. You claim to be a leader, yet your own people do not respect you. But we did as you commanded! These aren't sellswords, Asha. They're killers. Roderick! I can't believe I trusted him. I know you and my brother were in contact. Perhaps he told you things. Things that might prove his guilt. Perhaps you're not to be trusted either. Oh, you're not listening, Garrett. Shh! Chief and a lot, Castellan. You and ninety point three percent fought, brought Finn along. Oh, a lot of people. You and sixty point eight percent maimed Griff. You and eighty four point nine percent kept Sarah secret from Lord Tarwick. Oh, because she really needs that shit. You and 70.3% ordered the Glenmore soldiers to remain in Ada or Ironrath. You and 396 stopped Beshka from killing the slave master. Oh, yeah, but there is still, like, option that you killed him, or you didn't stop Beshka. So, I think it's quite even on all, all of those three options. Episode 4. 
it was quite good, but I kind of... I know th that it's a lot of episodes, but yeah, I just want to, you know, get more excited because this freaking game shuts you down all the time, like... You feel like you're progressing, and then you get bitch slapped in the face every single episode, so you, so you kind of know what to expect, you know? You know that nothing good is going to happen, and you're like, it doesn't matter what I do, it's just gonna get worse. At least I did something right, even though I died once. <laughs> uh, but yeah, it was good, pretty good. I, I'm kind of still stuck in the life is strange, so I'm all the time like when the game crashed I was like, oh, of course I'm gonna skip this chatting with RB <laughs> oh, But I can't. Oh, life is strange. I heard it's coming like uh, On the beginnings of the next month almost the next episode, which is a lot faster than on Telltale series, because Telltale series take a lot of fucking time to put out an episode, but Life is Strange is quite quick with it, which I'm really pleased at. I think they did it better than Telltale games, a tiny bit. I still love really much Telltale games, they have their own style, own type of humor, but Life is Strange just has blown me away. I am hungry. Don't crash. Bad game. Good game. Don't crash. Thank you. Okay guys, thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you for all of the love and support. And I hope you enjoyed my decisions on this episode. The next episode will be the fifth one. When you play the Game of Thrones, you win or you die. Cersei Lannister. Bye-bye!